I'm Beryl, and this week, I'm looking at ice cream. I'm wearing my uh, cherries in honor of the ice cream sundae I'm about to make. <laughs> Okay, I'm ready. I haven't made an ice cream sundae in, I don't even know how long. Fun fact, do you know why an ice cream sundae is called a sundae? In the 1800s, there were a lot of laws that were restricting what could and could not be sold on sundaes. So things like alcohol fell under that, but also carbonated beverages like soda. Ugh. All right, two flavors. So drugstores to get around this, on sundaes, instead of selling ice cream floats, would just sell ice cream and put syrup on top. And they called it a sundae because it was sold on Sundays. Cheeky, huh? Add a little chocolate. <laughs> and ice cream in America, it's beloved. But it's common pretty much everywhere around the world. It'll have different variations. It's not always made out of frozen milk. Sometimes it's ice, sometimes it includes noodles. So in celebration of arguably the most beloved type of dessert out there, I spoke to seven people in seven countries to see the different iterations of ice cream around the world. So this is the ice cream episode. Yum. <laughs> it's so good. Per usual, in making this episode, I've decided two things. One, my definition of ice cream is fluid. This is thematic, you know? And two, nothing can come from the frozen foods aisle. For all the ice creams that I missed and all the flavors I didn't talk about, let me know in the comments what ice cream is like where you live and what your favorite flavor is. I'm also curious about like ice pops or ice cream cones from the frozen aisle in the supermarket. I think that could be really interesting to see the different ones around the world. I don't know, let me know what you think. Anyway, let the ice cream social begin. I'll be here, finishing this Sunday. <laughs> This ice cream is special because it got a lot of things that are not found around the world. It's only in Africa. In este mercado vendemos precisamente las nieves tradicionales de Oaxaca, data del siglo XVIII. Faludé, ye dessert kamelan iraniye. Dessert iraniye faludé bude ki omuqa shahay qajari ya safaviyan koshkozaran bude. Sar dar sar tu basatu shunu dashta. Noi abbiamo questa tradizione del gelato, è nata in Italia da 2000 anni, anche di più, è una cosa antichissima. Also mittlerweile weiß es, glaube ich, jeder Zweite in Deutschland, dass, der, dass das Spaghetti-Eis in Mannheim äh, erfunden wurde und von mir. Ist was ganz Besonderes. Ice cream ay napaka importante dito sa Pilipinas dahil itong bansang ito ay napaka -ingit. Ang halo-halo dito sa Pilipinas ay parang default dessert. Aklınıza gelen tüm dondurma çeşitlerini yapıyoruz. Maraş dondurması olabilmek için salep olması lazım. Salep yok, Maraş dondurma yok. We're starting in the Philippines with one of the most colorful ice cream concoctions out there. Halo halo ay hindi ice cream sundae. Kasi ang ice cream sundae is just ice cream itself. Ang halo-halo literally means, in English, mix-mix. So, meron siya't iba't ibang klaseng ingredients na kahit ano ang ihalo mo. Ang pangalan ko ay Hena Remigio. Ang gagawin ko today ay halo-halo. Ang main ingredients ng halo-halo ay shaved ice, gatas, pinipig, ube, leche flan, langka, saba, cherry, nata de coco, at ube ice cream. May pinakalala ang mga Japanese na dessert na tinatawag nilang kakigori na meron siyang ice tapos meron din siya mga sweet beans. So from there, nagdevelop na yung halo-halo. Ang lasa ng halo-halo ay matamis. May mga texture siya na matigas, malambot, magaspang, at may madulas din. Ang halo-halo ay isang representation ng Pilipinas. Kasi, makulay ang halo-halo. Ang mga Filipino kasi is 
kilala sa isa sa mga masasayahing tao sa mundo. So, if you have a joyful heart, colorful din yung buhay. Next up, Germany, because this ice cream presentation made me smile. Spaghetti Eis hat die Form, sieht aus wie ein Teller Spaghetti und äh, ist natürlich aus Vanille Eis. Ich bin Dario Fontanella, Erfinder von Spaghetti Eis. Das ist ein Schlagsahnebett. Obendrauf befinden sich, das ist ein Vanille Eis, die durch eine Spätzlepresse oder eine Kartoffelpresse und äh, das soll die Pasta sein. Dann haben wir eine Erdbeersoße, die eben die Tomatensoße betreten soll. Und dann haben wir weiße Schokoladeraspel, die den Parmigiano ersetzen. Es ist erstmal sehr frisch, sehr geschmackintensiv durch das Vanilleeis. Es ist sehr zart. Also das erste Mal war ich 17 Jahre alt, das war 1969. Man ist auf eine Zahl gekommen, über 30 Millionen Mal pro Jahr wird in Deutschland Spaghetti Eis bestellt und serviert. Und es war eine heute noch Gänsehaut, eine totale Erfindung. In Oaxaca, Mexico, they make their ice cream using wooden barrels and the process is mesmerizing. Quien viene a Oaxaca y no prueba una nieve de leche quemada, Fortuna, no probó los sabores de Oaxaca. Mi nombre es Paulino González Martínez. Eh, soy el propietario de la nevería típica de la reina Siboney. Tenemos una de las más antiguas de todo Oaxaca. La nieve de tuna precisamente se elabora a partir del fruto de un cactus silvestre que se produce en la Mixteca Oaxaqueña. Y entonces de ahí se va y se corta la fruta que se llama giotilla y con eso preparamos precisamente la nieve de tuna roja. Y, y entonces lo que vas a hacer es este, sacarle la pulpa a la fruta, la vas a machacar se le va a poner el azúcar y el agua nada más y ya la pones a, a congelar a cuajar y de ahí le pones la sal de mar y la empiezas a girar dándole vuelta al, al cilindro de forma como ahora sí como se lleva a cabo el movimiento del sistema solar el sabor de la tuna es entre agrio y dulce pero como se confecciona con, con azúcar entonces ya se le da el punto y te da un sabor bastante agradable y es el sabor de Oaxaca ni más ni menos you can't talk about ice cream without including Italy, but we decided to look at granita. It's an ice cream adjacent cold treat. La granita è una preparazione si mangia tutto il giorno. Noi è un rinfrescante per l'estate, la, la cosa migliore che si possa mangiare. Grazie Filippo. Ciao. Mi chiamo Filippo Ruggeri. Oggi ho fatto la granita siciliana di limoni di costiera malfitana. La granita non è gelato, è una acqua gelata con zucchero e limone. La consistenza è data dallo zucchero che è anticongelante e quindi permette all'acqua di diventare morbida, profumata dal limone. Da antichissima, dai romani che andavano a prendere la neve sulle montagne e la conservavano in grotte nella paglia. Poi durante l'estate avevano questa scorta di ghiaccio che mischiavano con zucchero e succo, e succo di frutta e il sapore del il sole, del mare, del, delle nostre estati. Il granino di limone ha, sicuramente ti dà energia. This ice cream features a local fruit that makes it very particular to South Africa. For my ice cream, you don't need machine, you don't need a lot of things, just your hands. My name is Darling John Mangwanya. I'm from Zimbabwe. I'm going to make an African style ice cream. This one, it's got an African plant on it, and then amas. Amas is a milk that comes straight from the cow, and then it's 100% pure, no additions. I'm going to be using Nam Nam plants, same like berries. I like them because they have a nice flavor. I'll use half amas, and then I'll take sugar, cream, and then I'll mix it. I'll take my num num berries, crush them, and put them inside my mixture. Take an empty bag, pour my mixture inside the bag. I'll take another empty bag, put some ice under, then I'll shake it for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, the ice cream will be done. Once you take it, you'll be able to tell this is an African flavor. It's for me, I can recommend this ice cream because fruits, they are good, then it's easy to make it. 
In Turkey, the ice cream is stretchy, so I had to include it. Annem beni 1952 yılında akşam dünyaya getirdi. Sabahleyin dondurmacı oldum. Adım Atilla, soyadım Kanbur. Ben dördüncü kuşak dondurmacıyım. Maraş'taki en eski dondurmacı ailede benim ailem. Orta Asya'dan bu gelen tatlı çeşidi genelde Osmanlı saraylarında serinlemek için kullanılır. Bir dondurmanın en büyük katkı malzemelerinden bir tanesi salep. Salep yabani orkidenin kök kısmıdır. Salep de benim ailem olarak o dondurmacı Osman Ağa kullanmıştır. Dondurmaya o elastikiyeti, o aromayı salep verir. Tabi oradan sütü söylemeden geçemeyeceğim. Sütte, kullandığımız sütte keçi sütü. Keçi sütünün özelliği de diğer sütlerden özelliği. Biz de bu işi seviyoruz. Buranın da böyle devam etmesi için elimizden geleni yapıyoruz. And finally, in Iran, we're looking at a dessert that includes noodles and ice cream in a very special combination. Falude terkibi de işte ba şerbet o amigim falude. Dulaje İranlı yani falude. یچه خاصیه و خیلی هم خوشمزه. خب من جابر برفی هستم مدت 10 سالی که تو کار آبی و بستانی هستم اونا همه شون اینو میگن فالوده تقریبا مورد 300 یا 400 سال پیش فالودم تو ایران طرفدارای زیادی داره به خاطر چی؟ به خاطر اون موادی که داخلش هست ولی خب شربتش رو ما درست میکنیم آب و شکر و گلاب هست باز اینجا میگم داخلش گلاب هست گلاب هم که کاملا ایرانی هستش از اون طرف هم رشته رو میادیم. رشته هم وقتی از دستگاه میاد اون یه رشته خمیر شلیه. شربت رو که از قبل آماده کردی با هم قاطی میکنی، با هم هم میزنی. رشته وقتی سرما بهش داده میشه یه دفعه خوش میشه. خودش رو میگیره، سف میشه، میشه اون فالده ایرانی ما. ولی چیزی که معمولا ما میریزیم آب لیمو هست و شربت آلبالو. نه من تا حالا چیزی نشیدم. فالده اصلا کلا جداست. زیاد میگه ما فالده رو بسنی مخلوط کن به ما بده. چون هوا میگم به خاطر گرمی و هوا میچسبه تو اون هوا خیلی فقط تو تابستون به خاطر فالوده میان فالوده مزه شبیه هیچ چیزی نیست شربت که توش هست یه حس خیلی خوب و خنک و باحالیه یعنی میشه چیز فالوده به خوشمزگی دوست نداشت ice cream may seem like a superficial topic you know the idea that people around the world all like ice cream seems kind of obvious but if you really look at it food is this amazing equalizer it doesn't matter where you are who you are you have something in common with somebody on the other side of the world because of something so simple, in this case, as a dessert. And I don't know, There's, it's just something about that just makes me feel good. And that's why I make this series. And I hope that that's what you're getting out of it too. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Wenn man natürlich dann eine Portion Eis in Form von Spaghetti bekommt, ist es natürlich eine totale Überraschung und ein Genuss fürs Auge. La forma en cómo se elabora la nieve, precisamente es echándole todo, poniéndole en este caso alma, corazón y vida. Eso es lo que da como consecuencia el verdadero disfrute de la gente cuando viene a probarla. البته فکر نکنم هیچ ایرانی باشه که تا حالا فالدر امتحان نکرده باشه چون انقدر خوشمزه است همه ما هر چند سالی چند دفعه این امتحان میکنم فالدر رو همه دوست دارم انسانlar da genelde kahraman maraş dondurmasını diğer dondurmalardan daha ayrıcak tutuyorlar I think yung dessert is napaka importante sa bawat isa sa atin sa buong mundo dito. Ang halo-halo ay kilala ng bawat Pilipino. Yung halo-halo gustong gusto ko siya kasi matamis at saka malamig. Very refreshing. Rinasci, dopo che hai mangiato un gelato, rinasci, è rinfrescante, è meraviglioso, il gelato è una gioia. This ice cream is so special because it's your own. You choose your own flavor, your own taste for you. It's pure ice cream. 